Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Sphincter Lock in Daycare and Event Center. If you could please take your seats, we're about to begin. Hello, Mother. It's me. If you're seeing this, I guess something went terribly, terribly wrong. I wanted to make sure that you knew how much I loved you. And please send my love to my brother, Dito Buttercrotch, and my sister, Heidi Buttercrotch, and my other brother, Hans Buttercrotch, and my other sister, Beyonce Buttercrotch. Oh, and I can't forget my adorable, illegitimate baby brother. I can't believe it's not Buttercrotch. You probably shouldn't have let Daddy name him, but hey, it's your deal, not mine. I just wanted you to know. I lived a wonderful, happy life. Bye, Mother. I will miss you. And I love you. Very much. Okay, just read what's on the paper. What do you want me to do? Read what's on the paper. Read this? Yes. But I don't, I don't want to read this. It doesn't matter, just read it. Lars will be greatly missed by a lot of people. He leaves behind a loving family, great friends, and his pet goldfish. What? <laughs> he doesn't even have a fish. Fine, just say goodbye. Bye, Lars. I guess I'll miss you. We done? Yes, we're done. Good. When I first met Lars, we went out and we got chicks. And we had such a good time. I just, I don't even know if I have words. So I think that my feelings are best represented in song. When all the clouds... No, 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 stop. What? I don't want to hear it. It's not fair. I'll miss you, Lars. You were my friend. Today I say goodbye to more than just a friend. I say goodbye to a happy delusion. Lars Buttercrotch was everything right about being just a little bit wrong. He came to me eight months ago, at a time where he and I needed each other. And he was taken away far too soon. But today I will not grieve Lars. I will celebrate his existence on YouTube. And celebrating along with me are some very special people. Let's hear from Katie Did 24. Oh, Lars, you're going? How could you be going? You're going to be greatly missed. Oh, you, your witty last name, and, and the beautiful hair of yours. And now from Mume, 11649. Lars was my husband, yeah, yeah. Lars was my husband, yeah, yeah. Someone who was also touched by Lars was Beto Boy. Just want to say pass my respects to Lars. I only knew him a short time and he's been taken away from us. Lars, we miss you. With a heartwarming tribute, we have Baku. One of the many people Lars touched, and I apologize for that. Ms. Bugs in Rug. Oh, sweet Lars. I'm going to miss you so. You were my hero till the end. Rest in peace, darling. Would anyone happen to know if Lars had a will? Someone Lars appreciated and enjoyed 
Burnsy one two one. Without loss, this world has no role models. With a fitting tribute, we have Strike nine five one one. Some say he was a misfit, an outsider. Others that he was merely the strange blonde German who lived with Brian. But a few realize the truth that he was one not meant for this world. So please, ladies and gentlemen, join me now. Raise your glasses to the memory of Lars Buttercrotch, a legend among men. Someone who wanted to offer something special in Lars' memory. Abby wrote me. Many of us are heartbroken, none more so than Melody Elise. Lars was my twin brother from another mother. I can't believe you're gone. Goodbye, Lars. And now we have a special announcement from Winger1212. I am sorry to hear about your recent passing. But this is Darla Flankenmeyer, and I would like to offer my services. The loss of Lars didn't just affect people, it affected families. As we see with Mary Ann 712 and the whole 712 family. And now someone who touched Lars. Genetic blend. I'll never forget the last thing he said to me. He said, Joe, your hands are really cold. Hyundai Meg won meaning worst. In honor of my friend Lars, I went and found his favorite vodka. This is distilled in his, his hometown of Sphincterlochen. It's called Uberduken. Here's to you, Lars. And now, with a fitting tribute, we have Cooksters. So thank you, Lars Buttercrotch. I will totally, totally, horribly, awesomely miss you. People respond to grief in many different ways. Here's one of them from Kaylee Wyatt. Lars reached even over the seas, and he touched Stylus Brighton. He was very proud of that. And now with a heartwarming song, Cindy Ray. I'm not one for sappy goodbyes After all, I think you're still alive But if you're in heaven, can I make a suggestion? Ask God for a new last name Someone that Lars always, always had a thing for Sam Sarah Jade. I am going to believe that Lars is moving on to a better place. A better brain. Maybe a better Brian. Stars in your eyes, little Lars. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll be taking a pre intermission. Please make sure you check out part two of the Lars Truth.